Matthew Evans told Australia's Sunrise that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry hosted a private roundtable with CEOs, resulting in a $25 million pledge from MasterCard. He added that the $25 million pledge is equivalent to 5 million doses of the coronavirus vaccine. Mr Evans said, They were true statespeople. Meghan had this passion for focusing on the issue of mobilizing the private sector to invest more in vaccines and immunization. The Duke and Duchess hosted a private roundtable with Fortune 100 CEOs. MasterCard pledged $25 million towards vaccines and immunization which is equivalent to 5 million doses. So their leadership was critical. They were so passionate throughout the campaign and a pleasure to work with. Last month, the former royal editor of The Sun stated that Prince William had been snubbed by Hollywood event organizers in favor of Prince Harry. Following the announcement that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle were joining a star-studded lineup at Vax Live to promote the coronavirus vaccine, Duncan Larkham told Talcradio that Prince William needs to be invited to these events in order to raise his status above celebrities. The royal commentator added that the phone has stopped ringing for the Duke of Cambridge. Mr Larkham said, I don't think anyone will say I was wrong in suggesting that it is their royal tag which is why Harry and Meghan are able to command hundreds of millions of dollars. And also why they seem to be at the very top wish list of all these groups. That is the point, with Prince Harry and Meghan being available for things like these global concert events they're being asked and the phone's not ringing for William. That is the problem, that is why William needs to be there. He needs these big high-profile events that raise his status beyond that sort of the Hollywood A-list celebrities. That is really hard to do when you've got the younger brother being called up for invitations before you.